It started out as a normal morning for Taqueria El Puente, but that all changed just after 6 a.m. Some guy and this girl arguing 6.16 a.m. again. Coming through this uh, sidewalk here, guy was way ahead of the girl. From the footage that you can see up there, the camera, we, he went around the corner. Girl running behind him, all angry, yelling at him from what we can see because the camera footage cuts off right about here. He comes back around just like this with his hands in his pocket, I believe, or hands behind the back, bangs his head on the window. Gonzalo Rivera and his father own Taqueria El Puente together, and after nine months of renovating the building and five months of being open, the co-owners say they would have never expected something like this to happen. Never, never, not, never crossed my mind. You can see in the video after the unidentified man bangs his head into the window, he and another woman walk away from the scene. The owners say they've been in touch with police and are trying to find the people involved. But they hope that the broken window won't stop them from serving up authentic Mexican cuisine to the people of New Cumberland. It might slow us down, but it might bring us up from all the help in the, from the community. A sports system that has stepped up in the Taqueria's time of need. Having a strong community is really big. I won't lie to that fact because ever since this happened, from one day to the other 24 hours, checking the feed for the shop we have here, Everyone was so supportive and loving and just bringing positive vibes and doesn't cost a dime. The restaurant says despite the broken window, this won't deter them from reopening on Tuesday morning. In New Cumberland, Taylor Hess, WGAL News 8.